Hey everyone, this is Steve, and I'm going to show you how I use my MIDI Fighter Twister to run Sunday Keys by Sunday Sounds. Now right now I've got three areas of orange, green, and blue that are the same as the first part of this template, but I've turned some into knobs to have different effects for this unit. And in this example, I have a road sound and I want two different orange knobs to control four functions up here with the reverb, shimmer, delay, and the mechanical sound of the roads. So far, I have this knob set to turn reverb up and when I press and turn, it does the shimmer for me. So reverb and shimmer with one knob. Now I haven't set up this other knob yet and I found out it wasn't programmed properly so I'll show you what I do with that. Get out of here and go down to the MIDI Fighter Utility app. So looking at these color configurations, the second knob is the one that is correctly assigned to be able to both turn and push and turn. And when I click on it, I find that it is set to shift encoder hold. Now this top one I found out was not responding correctly. And the reason is that it was set for CC toggle. So to change that, I'm going to go up here, click, to down to shift encoder hold and then most important send that information to the MIDI fighter and when it does these light up and blink to show that it accepted now that that's done go back to main stage and let's see if I can correctly assign this I'll first assign this one by simply turning the knob. And that worked out okay. Now one technique I like to do to make sure that the push and turn works correctly is to actually hold this down and then go over here and hit assign. That way it's already in place correctly. See if I can do this with the hands that I have. Okay, so I've got the correct knob. I'm pushing down, click assign, and then turn that knob. Okay, that didn't work. Let's see if I can work it again. Oh, I know what I did. I'm supposed to choose this other knob. It can be a little confusing that the interface up here doesn't really match down here, but it's how we have to work it out. So, okay, I'll correctly assign this by just simply turning and then click to the other one after I hold this down. I'm gonna, I don't think you have to do this, but again, it's just a safeguard. I'm gonna hold that down. Click to assign this one, and then turn the knob while holding it down on the MIDI fire twister. Let's see if that worked correctly. Turn or push and turn. There we go. So now, with uh, two different knobs, I can do reverb, push and turn for shimmer, upper knob for delay, upper knob, push and turn for mechanical.